turned off mic, and I didn't realize it. Oh, really? She took us in here. This is her room. Oh, really? Yeah. Can you see it? You recorded it, too, then? Oh, yeah. Good. So yeah. That's, so that's where she started, then. She took her in and basically showed her room. No, I mean, the first stop, before we got in there, there was a strong... Oh, she was in She might have played in, in that closet or something. She could have. Because like, when I walked in there, it was like, stop, like, hello. Cool. Something's near me, too, because I can feel my... Here. <laughs> I wish it was warm so I could really get a feel. I'm so cold that yeah. I'm not picking up as well. So five-year-old little girl, mm -hmm. we should look up the, see if we can't find the history on the house. Now I know that the bakers that lived here, they had a sister, but she was, she died when she was born. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. the only child that I know that passed away that lived here. But that doesn't mean that's the only one I need. Yeah. <clears throat> Just to see if we could. Uh, can you try your rods again? Yeah. Please. I mean, she wasn't done talking. I just thought we'd go investigate some more. A couple more, but no receptacles, no. Okay. Can I start back in here? Did she come back in again? Oh no, she's in here. Did she leave? She might still be in there. But did we leave her out? And she's still in here. I think she was right in the doorway. Oh, she's still right over here. Right where we left her sitting at. Okay. Get back down, Alright. Now, Mike is here with us, and he kind of wanted to visit, too. And we kind of wanted to show him what you could do. Um, so, I'm going to have you cross the rods so that he can see that this is your room. That is deep. Good job, sweetie. All right, can you uncross them for me? Remember to push really hard. Good job. All right, now I'm gonna ask you the same silly questions again. It'll be fun. If this is your room, don't cross them. Good job. Okay, if this is your room, go ahead and cross them. Awesome! Very good job. Okay, let's uncross them again. All right, now we're going to do the age thing again for fun. I'm going to start counting down from 10 and you cross the rods when I hit your age, okay? We're going to start at 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four. Very good job. All right, can you uncross them for me? Thank you. I wish there was a way to figure out her name. Yeah. I don't know how to do that. Ask her if her name's Elizabeth. Is your name Elizabeth? No. So it's not the baby? No, she's saying she's five. Did you grow up in this house? Is this where you stayed your whole life you were here? No. So you moved here from somewhere else? Maybe. I got a question. Oh. Yeah. What? Was you here <clears throat> was you here before the house was built here? Uh -uh. Well, she said this was her room. Okay. In fact, she took us over there. I know something to ask. When you first brought us into your room and you kind of showed us around, you showed us the closet. Was that one of your places you like to play? Awesome. Can you point to the closet with the rods just for fun? Good job. Which the closet is behind me. Mm-hmm. Did you have lots of fun in there? If you did, go ahead and cross it. Cool. So you kept all of your, did you keep all your favorite toys in there? 
No. Did you did you play games in there? Cool. Did you have any brothers? Okay. Were your brothers older than you? Awesome. Um, did you have any sisters? No, no sisters? Just brothers. Got a question. Mm -hmm. Do you live here by yourself? Nope. Is there someone else here with you? Do you live with a lot of people? Just a couple people? Maybe just one other person? Is it a person that she lives with? Or is it something else? She probably doesn't really know that she's gotcha. Yeah. Um, do you get lonely now that the family has moved out that was here? Yeah. Do you hope that another family moves in? Maybe another family Maybe. with kids? Yeah, do you, want a, do you want a family with kids to move in? Do so you have somebody to play with? Yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> awesome. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and look through the rest of your house and you can follow us if you'd like or you can hang out up here and we'll come back up and visit you is that okay all right well then we'll talk to you here in a little bit okay i gotta stop for a little while I'm a little headache and i can't feel my knees <laughs> cool well there's one thing now we know why you can't breathe in that room yeah, I wonder if she got sick. <clears throat> it could be. And they moved her into that room. 1918 flu yeah. epidemic came through here. Yeah. These, these houses were already built, depending on when this one was built. Ours was what? Um, Which one? Our old one. You just lived right down in the corner, didn't you? 1905. Mm -hmm. 1905, yeah. Our old house, just two houses down, was built in 1905. So. It could be flu, it could have been anything. Yeah. If it was hard for her to breathe. That's just about any kind of illness. Is that what she said? Well, no, I'm not taking it because I can't breathe in there. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. <coughs> you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I fell over. <laughs> that was just me. And that's what I feel oh, like. Oh, my like I can't breathe. So I'm assuming. And why did it, I mean, up until she got done asking questions, I didn't feel anything but really feel heavy right now. I mean... It, I want to check out the staircase because that's really easy to me. Yeah, that staircase is weird. <clears throat> I love this camera. <laughs> like I said last time, I feel like I'm on dead files. <laughs> <laughs> There you are. Oh, Something different though, isn't it? Yeah. I'm catching something. It's like. Yeah. <coughs> Yeah, I need to move. <laughs> well, I'm trying to pick it up. I know. <laughs> there is more to that little closet right now. Cute wallpaper. Oh. Okay. My flashlight is dying. I just changed out the batteries. Really? Yeah, I literally just put brand new in before we came. Is there, but where's the mirror? I was like, where's the 
hanging out up here. You know, that's interesting because that's on the other side of that closet. Yeah. You're like below that closet. It's something funky. Right here. You think I'll just like stand here if you can and just see if you can't read it. Because okay. it's, it's cranky, but I can't pick up a color or anything on it. That's a good way to describe that feeling, though, up here is cranky. Yeah, it's like, like a and cranky. Oh, my oh. meter's going off in my pocket. Someone talking. Yeah, it's across the. Okay. It's the neighbors. Oh, I'm setting the meter off. Are you doing it or is it going off on its own? It's going off on its own. It's in my pocket. You, can you pick it up? It's like it's just out of my reach, right above <clears> my head. Like right in here? Yeah. Faintly, I don't get a lot. This whole area is weird. Did you say they had problems up here on the staircase? Mm-hmm. The At the top stairs. Maddie had uh, real issues with it. Of course, they're not going to stand on the stair. I mean, if there was something there, they'd have went right through it because they're not going to. Yeah. Huh. And whatever it is, I think just moved down here. I just felt. I don't, yeah, there's not. Mm. She was talking to the girl with something behind me. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there's something that likes you, Pam. Yeah. It's either that or me, because I just got the cold chills again. Come closer to me, so it's not off here. I know that's why I was headed that way. Maybe <laughs> it's thick in there. It's like it's clinging on you. See? Mm hmm. And you guys got it all stirred up. I'll tell you that. I don't. It's. Uh... Well, you're sticking us those in one room. You're going to get some fun. Come check this out. He'll talk to us across the rods. If you push these two sticks that I'm holding on to together, if you don't want to talk to us, cross the rods. Oh, yeah, it's a nasty little shit, isn't it? I don't know what it is, but it's not nice. And it's not going to be cooperative. That was Pam's line that made that noise. What is on top of that door? That's my recorder. Okay. <laughs> I left it in here. Oh, yeah. Something's falling on me. Yeah, there's something mm -hmm. right here. It's right behind my head. Where did I go? Ooh, yeah. I think you brought staircase dude with you. 
Oh boy, I just took my seminar and picked it up. <clears throat> so we got something on the staircase, we got something down here, we got something upstairs. Oh, let's see something, we got a little girl. Stairs. Who called me a little girl? I tell you what, if you guys would have come over here when Amber and Travis was living here, oh, they'd have moved out. <laughs> yeah. That's like our hospital. I wonder if that's why Penny never liked to spend a whole lot of time over here. If she's sensitive at all, she wouldn't want to. I wouldn't stay over here and drive me insane. But if they want me to, after I pass the little girl on, I can get rid of whatever this is. It's nasty. I'm sure they don't not. care now. <laughs> Stir it up, huh? Yeah. Send it next door. <laughs> I could. If you want me to. <laughs> if she's all about that, I will totally push the next door. I think, door. I I think we figured it out how to do it. Are you figuring it out? Oh, I know how to I know how to move them. I don't have to move them up or onto the other side. I can just move them. Okay. I gotta do something. I gotta no feeling in my right hand. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. You can tell? Has it moved out of here? No, uh uh. No? It's still right here. It's like right. You can walk right into it. Yeah, it's right in front of the store. Huh. 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 I'm just outside of it. Jess is like starting to go into it. laundry room. Let's go back there. I 
keep thinking, well, this light will help you, but I know you're not seeing this light that I'm looking at. <laughs> I don't know. It must have been. Probably this is the original. I know I put these freaking cabinets in this kitchen. You did? Yep. Okay. I just got a hit. Right here was where I was standing when I got a uh -huh. hit on the K2. Just you think it's a residual thing? Flash. Or maybe it's just not here right now. Wow. What? Something just went right up in front of me when I was flashing that. I'm going to flash again. Kind of decide if it's dust or what it is. Flash. Is it following you? Yep. You pushed me into another room. <laughs> Where am I at now? Hmm. I'm going to try it one more time. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's got a chill on at my back. I know it clings on your back of your neck. Eventually, I'll flash. Okay, here it comes, Flash. I'm not, I'm not seeing it now. Would you quit moving? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Well, I'm checking you. Oh. To make sure I'm not picking up anything. I'm just make sure what's up. Well, yeah, it, on you. it uh, when you start coming around this way, it left me. Yeah. There's nothing clinging on Pascal. I can read him from here. And that's just the IR light? Yep. Attached on? Or is it part of the camera itself? It's, well, it's part of the camera too. I mean, the, it looks good without that IR light on, but it just... It's really crisp. Very cool. Yay. Mm -hmm. That's going to make a huge difference in footage. Yeah, I hope we can... <clears throat> which we can play with this tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And see if we can get the that dowsing rods and put it on that on the website. Okay. <laughs> Did you get boost? <sighs> Got to chill. I'm gonna flash. If there's somebody here with us, there's a little orange light on that counter on the counter over there. You can talk into that and talk to us. We're not here to hurt anybody. Just here to communicate. That was a noise in the other room from Jess and Pascal. I did hear something. I was standing at the bottom of the stairs. That uh, noise from in this direction. Uh -huh. But like I said, don't know if it was next door or... Walking, by the way, anybody wants to know. What are you doing, Pam? Hmm? You're, you're texting, aren't you? No, I'm looking through pictures. Oh. <laughs> see if I can see anything. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> Never. 
Dude's still on the stream. Anybody want a piano? That come from Colorado. Wow. That was uh, Penny's grandmother's. Oh, yeah, that one's up there. It's a hospital. Those things won't seem to be. Yeah. You know, I didn't know if you guys want to come over here at night or not. And when Amber said, "Won't you go investigate the house?" I thought, "Well, I'll just go there by myself." And now maybe I don't want to go there by myself. <laughs> well, it might have been a little bit calmer if you come over by yourself. Yeah. It drained Pascal's battery. Did it? Yeah. As soon as I took a picture, just scales. Gone. I can stand on the staircase. It was my fault. So you're still picking it up on the staircase? Oh, oh, yeah. oh hello. Yeah. Did you get it? Yeah. Something. Look at this. Ooh. Look at this. Holy crap. There's no electric. No. There's nothing on in the house. Wow. Something yeah. should do it without the yeah. crash. Oh, it's it starting to move. Yeah. Girl. Are you the little girl? Did you follow us? No. It's moving on. What was that? That was Pascal moving. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> I heard something back that way. That was, oh, coming back. Wow, I really thought you moved. That was not you. Weird. Hmm. Something came through then. Oh, what was that? Was that your filming? <laughs> <laughs> Is that what was tripping this? <laughs> wow, that's some strong chili. Uh oh. That's some good stuff, man. Here we go again. We need, we need a little bit more warning for ghost hunts before chili night. <laughs> yep. <laughs> go up. See? Huh. I have no idea. Something just blur. Where'd it go? This house is weird. It is. It's an odd. No wonder the kids had such problems. Yeah. I wouldn't. A raven and go insane in this house. <clears throat> yeah. You know, and I'd never. I'd never thought of that before, you know, because when I was over here by myself, mm -hmm. I felt something, but not near like what I'm feeling tonight. And then with you guys being here. Well, you've got us here, and look at the heavy moisture in yeah. here, too. That's going to make a difference. Should make for some good pictures. There won't be a lot of dust particles. Yeah. Actually, it's not that bad. You still feeling it over there, aren't you? Yeah. It's seen. Ew. There's but a floor that's a amazing. Yeah, there's a dip right there. I caught that earlier when I went through there. It's trippy. Hmm. Oh, jeez. See that? Let's try that in that bedroom. 
Pastor, where you at? Okay. Don't worry, I'm not too far away from you. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to mock shame and a haircut. I'm going to mock it first and then tell you how we want you to finish it. It goes like this. So we want you to finish the next two knocks. The next, or the two end knocks. I'm going to do it again and I want you to finish it. I know, let's see. That was my phone. There's footsteps upstairs. There was? Yes. I moved downstairs. It's really low. Like on carpeting. seen something go across the screen in this other room. I guess you could say it was an orb, but It's a recorder, I hope. <laughs> yeah, it's a recorder. That's that crunchy sound. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Just went out, I could tell. Yeah, it still does a pretty good job without it. It's not bad. That was my <laughs> Pepperoni pizza. <laughs> See, this is where they always had their TV over here. Mm -hmm. And they said that they'd be sitting here in the middle of the room, when the, especially when uh, Kennedy and Trent was young. And then they said every once in a while they'd just stop. And, and it was like they watched somebody go through the room. The kids would? Mm-hmm. Huh? That sounds residual. I'm wondering if half of this is not residual. It could be. Energy pass, get created, walk up the pounds. I don't know how it fits good right there. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> oh. All right, so what's going on upstairs with me?
Yep. Like something in the other room. So to me, it sounded like a. <sighs> yeah, that's down upstairs. I heard it too. <laughs> You're not losing it. That's good. Because <laughs> I ain't got a whole lot to lose. <laughs> I'm losing it. <laughs> stairs here? Hmm. I need her be in over here. Okay. Did you miss us while we were gone? <laughs> well, we're back for a little while. We're going to hunt around up here for a little while and you can follow us around. Answer questions for us if you want. Would that be fun? Cool. All right. Well, I'm gonna go walk around. Yes. Oh. Yep. We're so glad to have you here with us. I'm gonna come into this next room. You want to go into this next room here with me? Yeah. All right. I'm heading this way. Okay. K2 meters going off with no electric in the house at all. Did this room belong to somebody you knew? That was the case that go off all the time. Did this room belong to some of your brothers? It did. Yeah, that's right now. It's a big room, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Interesting. <clears throat> Did your mommy and daddy live here with you? Yes. Did they live upstairs? Was there was their bedroom upstairs? No. Was it upstairs? You don't know? Okay, I'll ask again. Did your mommy sleep upstairs? Yes. Can you show me where her bedroom was? Is this way? Okay. Take me there. Point with the rods like we did before. Show me where your mommy slept. Keeps pointing. Did you and your mommy share a room? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did your daddy stay here? Did your daddy stay in this house? That's odd. That is odd. Did you know your daddy? Did you ever meet your daddy? I don't think so. 
Um, did she live with her grandparents? Her and her mom lived with her grandparents. Did you live with your grandparents? Your grandma and your grandpa? I think so. Okay. So it was your grandma and your grandpa, and you and your mom and your older brothers, right? Yeah? Cool. Was there anybody else that lived here with you? No. Well, at least we got something solid to go on when we go yeah. to bed, try to figure out. Hmm. And what else after? Can you guys think of anything? Did you know what town you lived in? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna list some names of some towns, and you tell me which one it is. Okay? Did you? We're not gonna play with them. All right, here we go. Did you live in Coffeeville? Did you live in Sedan? Did you live in Havana? Did you live in Caney? <laughs> I wish we could just figure out what her name was and how long ago it was. Yeah. Hmm. I have no idea how to ask her name though. Were there houses all around this house when she lived here? Did you hear Pam? Were there lots of houses around you? Yeah. Was the street made of brick? Do you remember the streets? Were they made with brick? Or were they dirt? Oh. Brick. brick. So they started bricking in all the streets back in the 1910s. 10s or 20s, I can't remember. The main one was bricked in first and then they started heading out. Do you remember going into town? Do you remember going to any stores? Do you remember any of the names of the stores back then? Um. Blackledge. It wasn't there then. No. Do you did you ever go to the mercantile? Yeah, there was a mercantile here before the thirties. There was a there was a uh, ice cream factory too. Did you know about an ice cream factory being here? Did she go to the parades downtown? Did you ever get to go to one of the parades downtown? Did you ever get to go see the livery and stables? Did you go see the horses? Well, that's at least. Does she know what a car is? Oh. Do you know what an automobile 